Welcome back guys, this is Alcoholic Endeavors, and today we are going to be making a purple bunny. Apparently this is the revised version. Um, I, uh, my mother, my other mother, <laughs> sent me this uh, recipe, and I tried it with the raspberry vodka because I was hoping to get out of using whatever was in it. Um, it calls for uh, chimboard or cumboard or something like that. Don't quote me on that, I'm not familiar with that. I've learned that it's a like a le raspberry liqueur of some sort, I think. Don't hold me to it again. But you know, I'm gonna try this, and we're gonna find out if it actually tastes really good. The like I said, the raspberry vodka was disgusting. I'm not doing that again. I was I was gonna test it and see if I could do it. I cannot. So we're just going with what I bought yesterday, which is the raspberry liqueur. So what you'll need for this drink, you'll need absolute vodka, you'll need some blue curacao, you'll also need a raspberry uh, liqueur. Now if you like things bitter, you could probably go with raspberry vodka. I wouldn't recommend it, but it's all preference, whatever, bullcrap. So, and you also need um, cranberry juice, I don't know why I can think of it. I'm very tired, I guess. You also need a shaker and a jigger, and your fat stomach on the bar. Well, that's unfortunate. I'm glad this bar is clean. It's fine. It's the only I'm the only one that's really drinking tonight. So whatever's on this bar is going into my stomach, which is a little questionable, but you know what? I will make it work. I need to stop making a mess. So, what you'll need is one and a half ounces of vodka. I'm gonna try to readjust how I pour, because I know when I usually record, I pour like this, and that's stupid. Though if I get really drunk, I probably won't remember to do it that way, so just gonna try. Not gonna succeed, but I am going to try. You need a half an ounce of blue curso. Should I be using the other side to actually measure? Yes, yes I should, but I am not going to. Then you need three-fourths of an ounce of raspberry liqueur, chimbard, chimbard, something like that. It's about three-fourths. I forgot if that was actually in view or not. It was kind of a little far out of view. Jesus Christ, I almost dropped that. It wouldn't have gone anywhere, but... It would have made a real loud noise. And then you need half an ounce of cranberry juice. Like so. Ideally, you want to serve this in a martini glass. I do not have a martini glass on hand. So, and you need it as served in a chilled glass, but also don't have that right now. Um, I need to actually get some glassware. I'll do it eventually. For now, I'm just going to put it in this rocks glass, and we'll go from there. Go ahead and shake her on up until it's chilled. What the fuck is this on the bottom? That's nice and chilled right now. And we're going to go ahead and pour it into our glass. Yeah, that's about the color I was expecting from the uh, from the picture. It looks a lot nicer since there's actually a light peering into it. Um, I'm not sure if I can get that light to peer into it. Eh, kind of. It looks black uh, probably on the screen, but it is actually a purple color. If I had like a light right here, it, you would probably be able to see that it's all purple. But overall, it looks good. It looks like it's supposed to be served with, like, mint leaves or something like that. So let's go ahead and try out the purple bunny. Oh, that is so much better than the raspberry vodka. Holy crap. Oh. Wow. That is actually really good. I would recommend it. I really do. Um... Let me, let me tell you what's going on with this drink, I guess. So right off the bat, I can definitely taste the raspberry liqueur combined with the blue curso the most. I don't really taste the cranberry juice because, I mean, that kind of just blends in pretty well. 
I mean, cran I mean, cranberry juice does have a taste to it, but I don't taste it as much with this one, I guess. Oh, this one doesn't really have too much of a taste. All right, well, never mind that. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I would. Uh, I can definitely taste the raspberry liqueur. Ten times better. It's a lot sweeter than uh, the raspberry uh, vodka. The raspberry vodka is just bitter as all hell. Um, but I mean, it's you can taste these two. They blend very well together. And you know, I'm not really big on the blue curacao, like a huge amount of blue curacao, because I've had it before. I've drank it in many drinks, but out of all the drinks I've had. I would like to have less blue curacao in any of the other drinks than all the other stuff that's in it. Because it just changes the taste just enough that it just doesn't... I guess it doesn't incorporate well with certain liqueurs and all sorts of uh, different types of drinks. Of course, there are some exceptions, but uh, for me, it doesn't seem like it incorporates very well with some things, and I don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> I got so distracted by the drop going down the uh, shaker that I was like, <sighs> sticky bar. Blue Curacao has a way of changing taste out of like anything that I've made before. I usually try to dumb it down quite a bit and use more of certain types. Like for example, I think I already posted up on YouTube or on our channel, um, the electric popsicle. At least I think it did. If I didn't, I can just tell you the recipe right here. It was Midori, Blue Curacao, and some Sprite. Equal parts on the Midori and the Blue Curacao, and the Sprite you can just do however much. Now, when I add those two to get it together, this overpowers the Midori. The Blue Curacao overpowers the Midori, and I don't understand why. It is just like, okay, well, something don't seem right, and I don't know why it doesn't seem right. But this, this actually works really well. For how the raspberry liqueur works and everything, it's, um... It is sweeter, but it also has... I don't know if I want to say tart taste. I'm not going to say it's a tart taste. Maybe tart taste. But it's, uh... It, it just blends quite well together. And then the vodka just, you know adds a little proof to it so you can actually feel something. And if I'm going to be doing a lot of these tonight, I'm going to be feeling something. Recommend the drink. It's, uh, it's really good. If you like that, go check out my other videos. We also now have a Discord, link down in the description. Give me a like, comment, subscribe, and I hope to see you all next time.